I, I, I'd hate to say any different. <laughs> That's the shadow from the tree. I thought I had a black eye. No idea where to go. Morning, everybody. Welcome back to the logbook. My name is Jeff, but people call me Joshua. <laughs> We're here in uh, Joshua Street. Joshua Street? Yeah. Good enough. <laughs> uh, we camped right here last night. Pretty cool spot. Really cool neighbors. Uh, yeah, and so we're uh, up here. This campground is called Jumbo Rocks. It's a good one for sure, but I've I've stayed at a few others and they're all pretty good. And uh, yeah, today, what do we do today? I feel like today is gonna be a pretty mellow day. This is fantastic. Plan today is to go into town and get a bunch of stuff that we're gonna need. We need breakfast, no, just dinner. Dinner, maybe some lunch. Joshua Tree Saloon, haha. <laughs> so we'll go in and get that stuff. Uh, the people next door said they were gonna give us uh, firewood, so that's good. Um, unfortunately, one of their friends got hurt last night, so it's gonna be a bummer firewood. <laughs> anyway. Today we're gonna go into town, grab necessary provisions to have a good night tonight, which will be a good, oh, I'm gonna cook a good dinner. I'm pretty excited about it. So stay tuned for that. Let's go into town and get our stuff for today. If I look um, really shiny, I just put sunscreen on. <laughs> sunscreen and water, big things around here. My bike looks so fuliginous. <laughs> that was the word of yesterday, but we're gonna have to get into service to find out what word of the day is today. Nice to meet you guys, man. Have a great day. I uh, hope your trip goes better. I think things are stable, so. Yeah, that's good to hear. Nice to meet you, too, man. Um, will do. I'll do my best. Yeah. <laughs> we'll live through your life through your YouTube channel. Yes, please do. <laughs> um, I hope you, those coins come in handy. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You'll, you'll have fun in Palm Springs, though, for sure. Yeah. Cool. All right. Thanks. Cheers. Yep. Get over here. <laughs> All right. Have a good one. Yeah, I, it's fun. All right. Cheers, guys. Good people, good people. Camping people are always good people. I think I've said this before, I'm not sure if it made it into the edit, but camp people are great. You can almost count on them being helpful, uh, good spirited, and uh, just generally a fun crowd. Same with boat people. And I'm gonna go out on a limb and say people who love dinosaurs. I don't know that for a fact. I only know one. His name is Turbo. And he's filming me right now. <sighs> Going into town. Look at all these spots. Just great camping spots. What a way to live. This is just gorgeous. I love it here. Just absolutely fantastic. All the Joshua trees. Funny enough, Joshua tree uh, it's genus is a bush. <laughs> I don't know. I, don't know I think uh, I think they got it wrong. But 
whatever. I'm not, I'm no uh, tree scientist or bush scientist, I guess, it, <laughs> as it would happen. are going to go to the Joshua Tree Saloon. The place is awesome, I want to show you it. But more importantly, I have to pee. <laughs> this place is rad. Not that busy. Guess it's shoulder season. I have no idea where to go. Yeah. That was backstage. Where do I go? What are you looking for? <laughs> Inside. Inside, right back down here. Oh, okay, sorry. Yeah. Right around oh. this corner. I'm an we idiot. <laughs> awesome people here. Alright, now I know where we are. Be few and far between. <laughs> All right, word of the daytime. Anal <laughs> analog. Analog refers to something that is similar to something else in design. Oh, sorry, something else in design, <laughs> origin, use, etc. In other words, an analog is analog analogous to something else. There's many historical analogs to our current political situation that we can learn from in order to not repeat our s repeat the past. Okay, this is the arcade. It's just a rim of impossibility. Oh, I bet you're getting stuck in there. I just gotta win one. There's a lot of selection. But after a lot of review, I'm gonna get a pork loin filet. I'm just gonna find the smallest one. Ooh, that's pretty small. Five bone. Yeah, let's go with that. It's gonna be fun. Oh, so, so rosemary and garlic and herb. That's all my three favorite things. That and going to the bathroom. Which it'll make me do. Now the important stuff. That could be fun. I think we're good. They put the, uh, the firewood as far away from everything as possible. It's like there, it's like porno mags or something like that. <laughs> you have to go so far, but I don't know if I need firewood. That's why I'm getting it. Firewood and firewood. So you know it's good. How you doing today? Good, how are you? Good. There you go. Uh, hello. All right, thank you. Thank you very much. I've already got a spot. Oh, okay. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Have a great day. If you're ever going to be on a road trip, it's kind of fun to get a park pass, national park pass. Um, you get to go in, it's I think 80 bucks, and then, but usually entry fee is about 25. So, you know, you go, they're good for a year, you go four times in a year, but it, what it really does is it makes you want to go to them. And generally, they're really good. Joshua Tree is one of my favorites, but uh, you know, I've never, there's not a sinker in the bowl. Big Bend <laughs> National Park was a little less interesting, but I did get to do a bunch of dirt riding in there. Uh, this, 
Uh, Joshua Tree doesn't really have much in the way of like off-road riding because it's so close to Los Angeles and I think um, people might take advantage of that. But either way, it's a it's a great it's a it's a seal, you know. If you're if you're on the road, sort of like I am. The we're gonna use cardboard as the bottom to for our coals. Because you wanna have you wanna have a flat surface to for the air to get through. If you put it right on the ash, then there's no air gets through, so you want you want that. I'm gonna use a lot because we got a pork tenderloin. We got a pork tenderloin that's gonna need a lot of time. And before you know it, we got fire. Okay, here we go. We got a roasted garlic and herb pork loin fillet. Let's cut this open and uh, make this happen. Most of that uh, petrol, and <laughs> I like the term most, of that petrol off the coals is probably burnt off. So it's time to start cooking. Oh yeah, that's good. Oh, this thing is huge. <laughs> that's the sound right there. Right, this is a monster piece of meat, so we're gonna Flip it a bunch of times. We're gonna do a, a mini flip. Oh, look at that. Oh, it's stuck too. Oh, it's gonna be fun. Some even cooking going. There we go. Veggie time. There we go. Uh, Check to see if it's done time. So normally you'd bring a uh, thermometer, but I didn't bring one. Oh, it's well done. Check that out. If you can see that, yeah, it's well done. A little pink. And let's chop that up a whole bunch of them for me. Cause I'm me, I want food. Oh yeah, that's good. Beauty. Awesome. I'm pretty excited for this. Thank you, me. That is fantastic. Let's try some of this veg. Also fantastic. Jeff, you've outdone yourself. Ah, oh, so juicy too. Yeah. I'd hate to say any, any different, uh, but my favorite uh, part of Joshua Tree is the sunsets. They are just epic. Sunrises too, but oh, it's so good. Let's go check it out. All right, let's go check out the wonder that is the sunsets at Joshua Tree. First, let's check out the wonder that is a huge dinosaur spine. Look how big it is. It's all the way over there. And all the way over there. Dinosaur spines. That's how you live in life. Well, unless you're a dinosaur, of course. <laughs> Thank you. 
As you can see, I am no longer in Joshua Tree, but I just edited that footage and realized that I never did a sign off. So here we go. <laughs> that day was awesome. Uh, you know, it was really relaxing. I didn't do a whole lot because I really just needed some time to relax, which I got. Thank you very much. Uh, so I hope you like this episode. It was a lot of fun. Uh, tomorrow we are going to do some stuff and it's kind of cool. Um, so you'll find out about that in the next episode. <laughs> uh, but if you uh, did like it, give me a mini thumbs up or a big thumbs up or a high five, it's all the same button. And uh, tune in to the next episode for what happens. Yeah, thank you very much. Um, go out there, find someone and make them laugh. I guess this little bit here is just an analog for what I was supposed to do when I was in Joshua Tree. <laughs> See you later. So. That's gonna be uh, the bulk of today, but let's go and check things out around here and see what's interesting. Well, interesting to me. <laughs>